Hi everyone and welcome to codingjust.com. Guys, in this video, I will show you how you can implement a search view in your Google Maps. So if I show you, this is our previous application and uh, here we are showing a Google Map. So in this video, I will show you how you can add a search view uh, above here and we will search for the location and then we will move to that location. We will move our camera like this, okay? So let's start our tutorial. In our previous video, we have uh, implemented the Google Maps and we have added all the dependencies. So if you didn't watch that video, so you can watch that video from my channel. And we will start our uh, tutorial. Uh, first of all, uh, we need a search view here. So I will uh, add a search view here. So simply type our search view. Okay guys, so as you can see here, uh, we uh, implemented the search view, but for this search view, we need a background. So what I will do, I will go to uh, my drivables and I will right click on this new drivable resource and I will name it BG search view I'll hit enter and let me add all the things here. Okay guys, so as you can see, uh, we implemented the background for our search view and you will find the source code link in the description. So you, if you want to copy paste this course, so you can uh, find the link in the description. Now what we will do, we will assign the, this background to our search view. So simply type BG search view. So as you can see here, this is our search view now. Now what I will do, I will go back to my main activity.java and here we need to create a variable for our search view. So private, simply type search view, android.widget and I will name it map search or map search view. Okay, so I will name it map search view. You can name it anything you want and we need to initialize this. Uh, so simply type map search view is equal to simply type ndv it means find view by id r dot id r dot id map search so we initialize our map and we are referencing to, to this map search view okay now what we will do we will add a query text listener on our search view so simply type map search view set on query text listener and simply type new new and hit enter okay and we will do our work inside this on query text submit when the user submit the search okay so first of all i will need a string variable in which i will uh, store my location or uh, the user enter text so simply to get the user enter text simply type map search view dot get query dot to string okay and we will need a list of address so address uh, will be the android dot location address so simply type address uh, list of address and i will name it address list address list and initially it will be null okay and we will assign a value to this address list uh, but first of all we need to check if the location if the location not equal to null so we will proceed our work and here inside this uh, if statement i will use the geocoder so geocoder and name it geocoder we will creating an object of geocoder class so new geocoder and pass the context of this activity so it is the main activity dot this and here i will add a try block so inside this try cage block we will get our location or our latitude longitude from this geocoder so simply type address list equal to geocoder dot get from location name and location name will be our location so what we uh, we are getting here we are getting the text query from uh, our search view and we are storing that query inside this location in uh, this uh, string location variable and we are passing it here and we will pass this uh, one here uh, for maximum results okay and as you can see here we got an error so if i click on this and cl i click on this red bulb add catch class so the error is gone now now what we will do uh, outside this uh, try catch uh, i will create an address object here so address is equal to address list dot dot get zero because we are getting uh, one result only as you can see here if you are getting multiple results so you can uh, you can add a for loop here okay and below here i will create a let length where variable let length is equal to 
and uh, new let link and inside this let link i will pass the address address dot get latitude and address dot get longitude so now we are getting latitude longitude as you can see here uh, in i'm uh, in uh, on map ready i am passing the hard coded latitude and longitude so from here we are getting the latitude and longitude from our uh, user search query okay so what we will do here uh, i will just simply uh, copy this uh, line from here or i will just simply cut it from here and i will paste it here and i will change this to late link okay and i will change this uh, title to location so it will get the location or the user intro text from our search view and below here we need to animate or move our camera so simply type my map dot animate camera and i will just simply type camera update uh, camera update factory dot new let link and i will pass i'm let link and i will pass 10 here okay so now what is the issue here new let link where will we okay uh let me remove this so okay uh we we need to use the late link zoom here so it will zoom the camera okay so simply pass the late link and here we will pass 10 so it will be the zoom uh, quality or duration you can say okay and i will just simply remove this from here and i will remove this and on map ready we will just uh, assign our variable my map to google map okay and uh, below here what i will do i will just simply copy this line or cut this line from here and i will paste it here okay so this is our code for search view and if i run my application now we will check if the search view is working or not okay so i will search for Islamabad and I will hit the search so as you can see our camera is moving and right now I am in Islamabad and let me search Mumbai so if I click on search so it will move to the Mumbai as you can see here and if I search Peshawar uh, let me search uh, my city Rostam and uh, we will hit on search okay so i think uh, this this address is not added in our map so let me search my main city if i search mardan and it will get get us to the mardan city so this is uh, my home city and that's it for this video guys uh, this is how you can implement the search view or implement search on your google map application so if you like this video please share this video with your friends and also make sure you are subscribed to my channel and the bell notification option is on so you won't miss the upcoming videos